Here's a little Panasonic AM FM radio with a combination four inch black and white television embedded in it. I bought this at a garage sale last weekend. It was filthy. Covered with paint, um, scratches everywhere. I had spent a lot of time with Novus and other cleaners getting it better. Unfortunately, it has a divot there on the speaker I couldn't do anything about. You have your AM FM dial. Up here you have your buttons to set the clock. On the left side you have a 75 ohm mini jack. I don't know how I'll work with that. Let's see, on the, the right side here you have your main on and off control, your tuning dial. You have your contrast, brightness, and vertical hold buttons. You have your horizontal hold and height, your earphone jack. Up here you have your um, what is that? I can't see. They have embossed it the same color as the case. Brightness and dim. So that has to do with the clock setting, your display. And if I put it on dim, it won't go back to bright for like a day. Then suddenly it'll be bright again. And here you have your auto and manual. That's if you want to flip this to watch television. Does the TV come on automatically or not? I have it set on manual. And your FM and AM dials. All right, let's check out the back here. Oh, one other thing about the clock that I find interesting. It has a little blinking dot there. That's seconds. I know, because I counted them to make sure there were 60 in a minute. Um, on the back, you don't have much. You have your TR4060P. It was made in, what, December of 1982? Is that what that says? Let's see, on the bottom. Oops, TV's gonna come on there. It's kinda hard to move this around. It's very unbalanced. The TV always wants to flip up. This whole case wants to flip up. Um, Let's see, listening to the radio here. Same kind of global support. We're on AM right now. I don't get many AM stations. We're member owned. And if you live or work in Marion and the surrounding It's got okay sound for AM. And sometimes when I press it to FM, it, it doesn't come on for a minute. Yep, we're okay there. So I'm not very few things that ever surprise me. Andre Agassi in his book, see? I'm not a big band scan. You people have heard radios before. So flipping it up, you see the television. This is kind of what makes it unbalanced. Back in the day, you would have raised your antenna from there. What's going on here? I noticed one thing when I was cleaning it, just by coincidence as I moved various things around, that I was getting a UHS channel. Not very well, but to a certain extent, I was. I can't quite remember where, but I actually made a little video of the time wondering if I would ever see it again, so if I don't pick it up here, I'll just insert that video about here. I'm sitting out here cleaning the 1982 Panasonic. I was turning the UHF dial and stuff. I'm picking up a station here. Not well. Well, here we are again. Sometimes audio, sometimes a little video. 
There's stuff there. You probably can't see it. I can. I don't know what station that is. Occasionally I can see the little channel indicator in the upper left, but I don't recognize it. That's interesting. The airwaves aren't totally dead. Well, let's take this inside and see if we can somehow get a signal into that television. Well, this turned into a bigger project than I thought it would. So I have a 75 ohm from the DTA box to a matching transformer to a 300 ohm mini connector into the television. That's a lot of interference and the mini connector is not sitting properly so I kind of have to hold it in to get a good reception but that's what it is so that's where they will go with it. It was hard here putting the channel selector analog on three. here for your Thursday. Looks like we're going to see some unsettled weather. Huh. 15 minutes could save you 15% or more on car insurance. I think all these connections I've got going have really caused a lot of interference. And I don't think this mini connector fits exactly right into the jack. But as a sort of proof of concept. Picture I see is probably about the same that you see. Usually what I see is better. <laughs> right now it's not. The camcorder's got a fairly good picture. You any ideas? Ooh, it does. There are lots of cool. Get a free quote at Progressive Duck. Caps there. That's all I ever wanted to do was come here and New York City. Uh... God has promised to bless those who bless. Think that I'm cheating with her friend. Well, that's kind of what the channels are showing today. So as you can see, when I remove my hand from uh, holding the mini connector, how bad the uh, signal gets. So that's a lot of connectors there going in there. I'm kind of lucky I got anything. Well, that's the Panasonic 4 inch black and white television and AM FM radio from 1982. Hope you enjoyed it. Thanks for watching. a little preview of a coming video attraction if I can just figure out exactly what it is and exactly how to make it work.